featuring the Florida State University Seminoles and the University of Florida Gators. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, your attention please. World leader, activist, and humanitarian Nelson Mandela passed away at the age of 95 earlier this week. Mandela famously said, sport has the power to change the world. It has the power to inspire. It has the power to unite people. With the backdrop of these powerful words, the NCAA asks that you please join us in observing a moment of silence. Thank you. And now, ladies and gentlemen, please rise as we honor the United States of America and join the University of Florida band under the direction of David Goss and the playing of our national anthem. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to meet the starters for both teams. First, the Florida State Seminoles. A five foot nine inch junior from Fort Myers, Florida. Number two, Katie Mosier. A six foot two inch sophomore from Stewart, Florida. Number five, Nicole Walsh. A five foot 11 inch junior from Stewart, Florida. Number 10, Sarah Wickstrom. A six foot five inch freshman from Ruskin, Florida. Number 12, Sarah Burrington. A six foot three inch senior from Kennesaw, Georgia. Number 14, Ashley Neff. A six foot five inch senior from Stewart, Florida. Number 23, Elise Walsh. And a six foot one inch senior from Serbia. Number 24, Olivera Medic. The head coach of the Seminoles is Chris Poole. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's meet the starters for the University of Florida Gators. A five foot seven inch junior from Muncie, Indiana, number five, Taylor Unruh. A six foot two inch sophomore from Orange Park, Florida, number seven, Gabby Mallet. A five foot 10 inch senior from Crystal Lake, Illinois, number eight, Taylor Brownice. A six foot sophomore from Slovenia, number nine, Jivo Rachek. A six foot one inch senior from Gainesville, number 10, Chloe Mon. A six foot two inch sophomore from Fairfax Station, Virginia, number 16, Simone Entry. And a five foot seven inch junior from Ocala, Florida, number 30, Holly Pole. And the head coach of the University of Florida, Mary Wise. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's play NCAA Volleyball. Action. Florida State, number 16. Florida, number six. In-state rivals bidding for a chance to go to the Sweet 16, a spot in Champaign, Illinois, in that region. Tom Collette, Missy Whitt Whittemore with you. FSU in the court to our left, wearing the garnet tops with the gold numerals and lettering trimmed in white with the black shorts. Florida in the court to our right with the white tops with orange and blue sleeves, orange numerals, blue lettering with blue shorts. Chris Poole in his sixth season at FSU, 145 and 40, 27th season overall. Of course, many of those years at Arkansas, 695 and 270. Mary Wise, 714 and 83, and 23rd season in Gainesville. 27th overall, 795 and 146. 
The officials, the R1, Paul Albright, the up official, the R2, the down official is Mark Prather. We heard the Gator starters for FSU, Katie Mosier, Nicole Walsh, Sarah Wickstrom, Sarah Burrington, Ashley Neff, Elise Walsh, and Olivier Medich. Florida State will serve to open the match. It will be Olivera Nevit, Medic, the senior from Serbia, who wears number 24, back beyond the end line, right side extended. Florida will pass pole right and Unro left. We're underway. Pass Unro. Gators go to the outside to Mallet right away. Gabby Mallet gets on the scoreboard with an angle shot for the kill. Gabby Mallet not in the match last night due to injury, and here she is, her first swing of the game is the first swing of the game and already a kill for Gabby Mallet. Good start for Gabby. Here is Simone Entry serving for Florida. That means Mon is on the court. They will go outside. A swing and Jiva got a hand on it, but it goes back over our head. A kill for Nicole Walsh at a match high 15 against Georgia Southern last night. So Walsh makes her presence known right away as the two outsides get involved early. Serve for FSU. Gators go outside to mount. Roll shot. Played up in the back row by Medich. They go middle. Neff is blocked by Chloe Mon. They keep it alive. They get the ball across. Mon can't keep the ball up, so it's a kill for Walsh again. I thought the Gators thought that the ball was down. Well, Florida didn't get a good first contact on serve receipt. It was a one option situation, and immediately Taylor Unruh smacks her side. She didn't like that pass. She was able to put it up, and that's what it comes back to. So Burrington with the serve. The ball is a joust at the net. One by Florida's. Taylor Brownice for tied to two. Another tough pass, but Taylor makes something out of it. That one's traveling over the net. Taylor has to go up and really battle. Two Florida State blockers are up against her. Serving for the Gators now is Taylor Brownice. And we'll go silent as Brownice approaches, and her float serve is in play. Pass Medich and back left. They go to the right side to Elise Walsh. Off hands, dug up by Jiva. Gators go middle. Mon has to tap it across with a roll shot. Medich plays it up. They go to the outside to the other Walsh, and two Gators touch it. Holston up the net, then Jeeva Raycek, but it's another kill for Nicole Walsh, who is already three for three. She's the, got all three of their points. On the first Walsh swing, it was Elise on the right side, and Gabby right. Mallett got a really nice touch on that ball. Florida defense was able to pick it up, but the second one to Nicole Walsh on the left side, only one blocker up for Florida. Haley Luke, their other setter, checks in. She'll serve it now. Here is her jump float serve. Down the near side, pass Raycek. Not a great pass. Gators go right side to Holston. She is blocked. Big block on that side. Up was Neff along with Walsh. It's 4-2 Florida State. Ashley Neff is 16th in the entire country in blocks per set. For three years in a row, she's led the ACC. Serve again for Luke. Gators make a good pass here. Go to the middle of the mall, and she hits it off hands. They go to bump it to the outside. Here's Walsh, and she hits the ball in the net that time. First miss hit for Nicole Walsh on the night. And, and it's 4-3. Interestingly, Tom, the first time that Chloe Mon's gotten a really solid close on her, there's not as many options for their offense. Chloe was able to get out there, and while she's aware of that, trying to hit around her, she creates the error. 4-3, Florida State leads early. Here is O'Rourke checking in for the Gators and serving past Medich. They go to a shot behind the setter to Neff, and Neff kills it. Neff on the slide, so they're splitting that Florida block, and when they have a good pass, as we talked about with Dave before the match, it's a very fast offense. 5-3, Florida State serving for them. Here is Nicole Walsh, the younger of the two Walsh sisters. Gators go outside to Jeeva. Her first look is in for the kill. Good look for Jeeva. Had her shoulders facing the angle, came across the body, and rifled one down the line for the kill. It's 5-4. A pretty fast pace tempo out to Jeeva as well. Allows her to swing against just one blocker, and she finds the corner. Here's the uh, SEC libero of the year serving for the Gators. That would be Taylor Unrow. Another bullet serve there. Medich with the pass in back left. They tap it across, and Gators can't play it up as it's a kill for Mara Green. Mara Green has been effective in the middle for them. So has Sarah Burrington. This time it's Green, the sophomore from McDonough, Georgia, getting the kill to make it 6-4. You hate to let that off-speed fall. When they, don't, when they don't have a good look at the ball, we've got to play that one up. Here is their libero, Katie Mosier, to serve. Floating serve, and it's an ace, as Nikki O'Rourke can't make the pass. Make it 7-4, Florida State. Jeeva was sort of half in, half out of the serve receive there, and she split that ball right between Jeeva and Nikki O'Rourke. Mosier, Mosier's 14th ace on the season at 7-4 FSU. Pass, O'Rourke. Gators go to the outside to Jeeva. Tap shot is too short, it's in the net. Tack error for Jeeva Raycek, and not the start Mary Wise and the Gators 
wanted to see here in the O'Connell Center tonight. Get a big kill from Gabby Mallon, who did not play last night. And since then, it's been Florida State on the offensive, hitting at 556. The Gators at zero to this point in the match. And Mary Wise takes the Gator timeout. We'll step away as well. Once again, it's Florida State 8, Florida. Back after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. O'Connell Center second round action in the NCAA tournament. Florida State leads Florida 8-4 here in the first. Let's pause 10 seconds for station identification. You're listening to Florida Volleyball on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Tom Collette here courtside from our broadcast position. Missy just Got out of the Gator huddle. Let's get a report from Missy. Tom, Florida not getting anything from Florida State that they didn't expect. Mary Wise's message to the Gators is we simply have to play better. Not happy with some of the first contact, loving some balls that were off-speed shots fall. Thank you, Missy. And speaking of not a good first contact, not a good contact by O'Rourke on the pass. Taylor Unruh sprints all the way over to make the second contact in an out-of-system play. A kill for Jeeva Raychek to make it 8-5. And Mary Wise takes a deep breath and looks at O'Rourke says, calm down, let's get this thing going. They bump one to the outside as Florida State Metch his first look, and she airmails everything, seeing two Florida blockers there. It's 8-6 after the Medich attack error. Gators within two as Holly Pohl will serve it again. Flat-footed serve on the way. Pass, Walsh, they go middle. Gators dig it up, they dig up Burrington. Go to the outside to Raychek, off hands. Plays made by Walsh, they go to the right side. And a kill on the right side for Mara Green. So the Mara Green kill, and it's 9-6 Florida State. For them, here is their other setter, Sarah Wickstrom, checking in, along with Elise Walsh, as Green goes to the bench along with Luke. Here's the serve for Wickstrom. Pass far side pole, not a great one. Tracked down by Brown. Nice go to the outside to Raychek, dug up by Mosier. They set the outside. Medich with a rip. Wow. Florida with an out of system look from Jeeva Raychek. Florida State passes the ball right into their setter's hands and a big hole in the block for Medich on the left side. She really ripped that one. Here again is Sarah Wickstrom to serve. Gators pass three. Pole, Unroe middle, and left O'Rourke. Pole with that pass. Raychek on the outside, misses everything. Long. Again, ball to Raychek. This is not Florida at their best. They've got to. Get, a, get settled down on first contact, find a way to get the balls to the middles. Five point Florida State lead here early in this first set. Serve for Wickstrom, pass pole. Brown Ice goes middle, entry is dug up by Mosier. They go to the pipeline attack from Walsh and she misses everything long. Florida State looking for a touch, no call forthcoming there as Nicole Walsh's attack is long from the back row, make it 11-7. Can the Gators score some points while serving? Have been one and done except for Poles too. Bump it to the outside. Here's Medich. Big rip kill. Wow. Medich, wow. That time two blockers there. They were out of system. It's a high set. Gators are waiting on it, and she still unloads on that ball. She is matched up here against Taylor Brown Ice, and she's taking advantage of a bit of a shorter block. Medich now serves. Pass Unroe from back left. Gators go to the slide, and it's blocked. They were waiting on it. Two blockers there. You know, Burrington Florida, was there along with Walsh. Florida hasn't passed well enough to use their middles, so when they finally do get a good pass, Florida State is just betting on the fact that they're finally going to go to Simone, and they're all over it. 13-7 Florida State. Pass pole. Brown Ice goes to the outside. Mallet misses long. Florida out of sorts here in this first set. 
And Mary Wise wants to take another timeout. Smiles all the way across the Florida State bench as the Gators have not played sharply here in this first set. As we go to Florida, second called timeout. Florida State hitting 357. The Gators at negative 67 on the match to this point. First set from the O'Connell Center, Florida State 14, Florida 7. Back after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. State 14-7 in the first. Teams break huddle in the second call timeout for the Gators. Let's go to Missy for a report. Tom, Mary really challenging her team to get back in there and fight. She says it looks like we got punched in the face and we're backing away. And that is not at all the response she's looking for. Thanks, Missy. After the timeout, serving again for them is Medich. Gators pass three. Unruh with that pass and left. Gators go to the outside to Gabby Mallett. Off hands, they play it up. They go to the right side, Elise Walsh off speed shot, played up by Brown Ice. Second contact, Gators sent across a free ball, played by Elise Walsh. They go to a, a slide play, and they'll get a kill from Sarah Burrington. They are firing on all cylinders, and they lead by eight. They've more than doubled the Gator score. D'Agostino will check in now for Taylor B. A change at the center position for the Gators. She calls to her hitters where she wants to go. Medich to serve it again. They have served it very effectively here tonight. Gators haven't passed it particularly well, making the Gators offense predictable. There's the whistle from the up official, Albright. And here's the serve, right, left to right across the radio dial. Unruh with the overpass, and somehow D'Agostino saves it. Played across as she kicked it to D'Agostino. They will go to the outside, and a kill for Nicole Walsh. 16-7. And that Florida kill, not sharp at all. That kill from Nicole Walsh it isn't just a kill, it's a bullet if you're here in the gym. It's a momentum builder. Again, Medic to serve for them. Sound like a broken record. Short one. Pass is almost an overpass, but played. And Gabby Mallett misses everything going long. And of course, you wonder with the injury that's been nagging Gabby, if that is something to do with a couple long misses on her part. And immediately now we're going to see a change with Noami Santos laying injury in the lineup for Florida. 17-7, Florida State. Medich serves it yet again. Sixth time in this rotation. Set to the middle, entry off hands, dug up by Medich. Goes across the net, and the Simone entry just sends it back with two hands for the kill. And Tom, no matter what happens here in this first set, Florida's at least got to get some momentum back on their side. They've got to make a few good plays here. Entry to serve, that means Chloe Mon is back on the court for Florida. Gators in a deep hole as they make a pass, go outside to Walsh. Gators block it! D'Agostino is up alongside, I believe, Chloe Mon there to be part of the block. She goes right at McKenzie. She was swinging line there, knowing that the small block was up, so credit McKenzie for holding her own. 17-9, entry serves again. They pass, they go to the right side to Walsh, and Paul can't dig it up. Eighteen nine after the kill for Nicole Walsh. Serving for them, who has just checked in, is Laura Dadowski, one of their defensive specialists. Pass Unro. Gators go middle to Mon. She taps it across. They keep it alive. No, it's a lift violation call. Eighteen ten. Gators in double digits. Alex Holston checks in, Holly Pohl checks out, and Mackenzie D'Agostino to serve. Here is her bullet serve, it's too long. Maybe a little adrenaline there in Mackenzie as she rifles one beyond the end line. 
Mara Green checks in along with Haley Luke. Luke, the other setter. And Green, the other right side for Florida State. As Luke will serve it. Down the near side, past Jiva. D'Agostino goes to the outside to Santos Lamb. Big rip from Noami there, and she gets into the huddle with high fives all around. You know, I watched Noami in uh, warm ups because I had a good, you know, we had a chance, good feeling she would be in this match possibly tonight. Her jump, which she's been lacking all year, you could see the adrenaline. She had a little more under her legs. And now she'll serve, and she serves a bullet. They'll pass it across the net. Will the center? Gators take a swing. Holston does. They will play it up. They go to the right side. Roll shot played up by Mon. Gators scramble. D'Agostino sets the pipeline. Santos Lamb is played up by Medic. They go to the middle. Gators can't play it after a touch from Jeeva Raychek in the middle of the court. Goes as a kill for Neff. Credit Noami for a beautiful serve there. She really put something on that one. An awkward set from Florida State. That setter coming out of the back. They didn't quite make it to the net. You wondered if they'd call a double contact on that. Nicole Walsh serves for them and serves it airmail style beyond the end line. Make it 20 to 12. Unro to serve it. Can Unro spin some magic here and get the Gators back in set number one. Well behind here with Florida State already at 20. Here's the Unro serve. In the net error. 21-12. For them, here is their libero, Katie Mosier to serve. Gators will pass three. Unro taking half the court over here in left. It is Maddie Monsere, and on the left sideline is Jeeva Raychek. Here is Mosier, the junior out of Fort Myers. Pass Monsere, Gators go right side to Holston. She's been ineffective, she misses again. She is 0 for 3 with an error. Holston does not miss very often as a freshman. Her strength has been her consistency and her high hitting efficiency. And we're going to see Taylor Brownice back into the match. A little different set, obviously, from a different setter. And maybe Mary Wise feels like the errors will be reduced with Taylor being back on the court. Here's the serve. Pass on at the last minute. Gators go to the outside off the net. Great check. Dug up easily by Walsh in back left. They go to Medich, and Medich is blocked. No, it's in the net. I take your, I beg your pardon. She was well into the court, uh, trying to make a play on a set that was dying between outside and middle, and she goes for a roll shot but just doesn't get enough on the ball. Here's Holly Pohl to serve, back in the match for Holston for the Gators. They go to the outside, here's Medich, off hands, Pohl can't get there. So they go right back to Medich after the attack error on the roll shot, and she delivers. It's 23-13. Florida of the gets a touch on that one. Blocker's in position, but Medich blasts it off their hands. Nobody can run that ball down. Wickstrom and Walsh back in. That is Elise Walsh on the right side, and Wickstrom is served. Here it is. Pass far side, Unro. Go to the outside to Jeeva. She swipes it off hands. No, she doesn't. She just misses. And that's not a real bad pass. It is tight. But it looks like Florida should be able to get a couple options out of that. And we end up with the Jeeva Raychuk off speed out of bounds. Set point, Florida State 24-13. Again, Wickstrom serves. Pass Unruh. Go to the slide play. Entry off hands gets the kill. 24-14. Unfortunately for Florida, they have to score 10 straight points. And Jeeva serving. Certainly not out of the realm of possibility, but you think of the side out offense, Florida State will score something. They go to the outside to Medich. Pole digs it up. Gators go middle. Entry got it in for the kill. So back-to-back -back kills for entry as the Gators have been able to push a few balls to the middle. And hopefully just create some rhythm here at the end of this first set. That was a good look for her off two feet. Pass, Walsh. They go to Elise Walsh. She catches some net tape. Gators keep it alive. Entry poked it across. They play it up. They go to an off-speed shot from Burrington. Joust at the net, won by the Gators. FSU goes to the right side to Walsh. And Mallet goes down to the floor and can't play it up. So Florida State gets the point there on that long rally and takes the first set by 10 points here on the Gators home court by the count of 25 to 15. In the first set, Florida State hits a sparkling 4.07 and limits the Gators to a hitting efficiency mark of only 36. Gators with nine kills, eight errors, and 28 swings. As Florida State has 15 kills, only four errors, and 
27 looks. Gators trail after one set here in the O'Connell Center tonight in second round NCAA action to the Florida State Seminoles. Stay with us, Missy and I back for the call of set number two after this timeout on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Hey fans, did you know that more than 50,000 student athletes compete in NCAA championships at more than 800 sites across the country annually? You can find a championship near you, visit NCAA.com slash tickets and experience it live. looking to set some adjustments they're making but Mary lets the players know we've got to help her out with some better first contacts and she says hey let's answer the charge right here. Thank you Missy for Florida State. It's Elise Walsh, Sarah Burrington, Nicole Walsh, Sarah Wickstrom, Katie Mosier and Olivera Medic for Florida Raycheck to serve it to open up the second with Paul Unro, Mallet Entry and Brown Eyes. Jeeva Raychek ready to serve as Medich passes right. Middle is Mosier and left is Walsh. Here's the pass. Pass Walsh. They go to the outside. Walsh with a roll shot, partially blocked by the Gators. Played up by Raychek. Go to the outside to, excuse me, Mallet. They play a roll shot from the back row. Gators played up behind the block. Entry sends it in the back right for the kill. Back left, excuse me. Back left and Menich in back right couldn't get there. One nothing Florida after the kill for Simone Entry. Raycheck ready to serve and there's a wet spot on the floor where I believe it was Menich went down to try to make that play. Yes, in back left. She will now go back and pass in right. Middle will be Mosier and in left it is Nicole Walsh. Here is the serve for Jiva. Pass Walsh from one knee. They go to the right side. Here is Elise Walsh and Elise Walsh buries one from the right side. Tied at one. And you see the tempo they use to the left and right hand ten and not a high set. It's a hard Quick. order for those middle blockers to get out there and close. Burrington serves for them. Pass pole. Gators go middle. Entry is dug up. They go to the outside to Nicole Walsh and she hammers straight down. Credit FSU Ouch. though. That was a clean contact by Simone Entry. And their setter dug it straight up. Really nice control on first ball. 2-1 Florida State. Burrington serves it for them again. Pass pole. Brown has to run to track it down. Throws it out to the outside. Dug up by Walsh is Mallet. They go to a back row attack. Gators will play it up. Pole. Gators go to entry. She is dug up and the ball goes across the net across the other side outside the antenna. Kill for entry. I like it that Florida's getting the ball to the middles. Now we're tied at two after two kills to open up this set for Simone Entry. Entry will now serve. 
And that means Chloe Mon is on the court. Gators have been unable so far to score points off serve. Pass, Walsh, Nicole Walsh. They go to the right side to Elise Walsh. Dug up, entry play, second ball. Sent across by Raychek. They play the ball the outside to Walsh. Dug up by the Gators, so it's across the net. Neff, partially blocked by Mon. Gators go to the back row to Jiva. Jiva is dug up by Wickstrom. They pump one to the right side. Elise Walsh, roll shot, played up by, who was that? Entry, and Mallet can't get to front left to make the play. Kill for Florida State. In is Mara Green and Haley Luke. Out are Wickstrom and Elise Walsh. And in a game like this, it's going to take some transition digs. That means you're going to have to dig some of the hard ones into your setter's hands and be able to transition that to score points when there's two good teams on the court. 3-2 Florida State. There's the serve. Gators go outside to Mallet. Angle shot. Dug up by Walsh in the net. Can they play it over? Yes, they will, but the ball will go out of bounds. Tied at three after what will be deemed an attack error. They were just trying to, in self-defense, get the ball across the net. For the Gators, here is Taylor Brown, I serve it. Holston back on the court for the Gators as Pole is out. They pass three with Medich in the middle of the serve received. Walsh to her left and to her right, but this is Medich. They go outside to Nicole Walsh. Off hands, dug up by Jiva. Brown Ice goes to the outside to Mallet. Off hands, kills Gabby Mallet. And the good news in that rally is that Florida finally got a touch on Nicole Walsh out here on the left yes. side. Slowed her ball down just enough to transition it up until now. She's had free reign. Gators with the lead at 4-3. Gators only second lead of the night. The first was at 1-0 at the stop at the start of the match. They go to uh, Neff, and she sends one into front left for a kill. She runs the slide, but that is completely with the intention of dropping that one right over. She knew exactly what she was doing. Uh, blocker goes up, and that leaves some open space there for a tip. That's a senior play. Nicole Walsh to serve for them, the sophomore. Martin County High School in Stewart, and she airmails one long. And she's had serving woes all night. She keeps mailing them long. 5-4, Florida in the lead. Mallet out, Maddie Montserrat in. Gators had some passing issues in the opening set. Some of those were Nikki O'Rourke, but those interchangeable defensive specialists the Gators have. Tap shot across in the front left again. There's Maddie Montserrat diving in to play it. Gators sent across a free ball, played by Green. They go to the middle to Neff. Dug up by Montserrat. Jiva bumps it to the right side. Holston swings and off hands. That's a kill for Alex Holston. The FSU players are going, what? They didn't sell it very well. That was off hands. We saw it right here courtside. How about Maddie Montserrat? What you get from her is always fearless play. Two huge digs in that rally. And how about a nice bump set from Jiva? Short serve. They play it. They bump one to the right side from the back row. Walsh dug up by Maddie Montserrat and left. Brown Ice goes to the right side with the back set to Holston. She's dug up by Mosier. They bump one to the outside. Walsh from the back row. Dug up by Montserrat. Go to the middle. Chloe Mon gets it down for the kill. Gators on a slight roll here with a three-point lead at 7-4. Great work by Taylor Brown Ice. You know, those first contacts, they're getting them up, but they're out in the middle of the court. She's tracking them down, getting around them. She knew she needed to get that ball to Chloe Mon. Very well done. Maddie Montserrat. We'll serve it again. Beyond the end line, right side extended. Medich left, Mosier middle, and Nicole Walsh right. On the court with Neff, Luke, and Green for them. Here's the serve from Montre, a short one. Played by Medich near the net. It's a back row attack on Florida State. Chris Poole wants an over the net violation. That ball's in the plane of the net. And the up official explains it from across the court to the down official who is still talking with Chris Poole as Mark Prater. Fans want play to continue. It's 8-4 Florida. Can the Gators continue on this roll here and build on this lead? Another short serve. Pass by Medich coming in. They go right side to Green, and Green hammers it for the kill. And Tom Gators supporting Gators here tonight as I look into the crowd section and in the front row with a lot of the faithful fans of Gator Volleyball is Patrick Young with the student body. Leading nice. Up. Here's Mosier serving for them. Pass Montserrat, Brown Ice, back set, Holson against one. They block it back and play it up. Gators go to the outside to Jiva. Got it down for the kill. Gators finding an offensive rhythm here in the second set. After hitting only 36 in the first, 
They have been more effective on first contact. Part of that has been Matty Monsere, who's been a spark for the Gators and serve for C. Make it 9-5. Here is Taylor Unro serving for the Gators. Overpass, Jeeva swings and misses. Had a golden opportunity, arched her back, reached back to get it, but missed. That's a tough one because it is that opportunity. You hate not to take a swing at it, but it was so high that Jeeva was on her way down. That's why the arching of the back and the ball just uh, travels a little long. Oh, golden opportunity for the Gators goes by the wayside there. Here is, for them, Sarah Wickstrom in to serve. Pass Montserrat, Brown Ice tracks it down, back set, right side, Holston blocked. She plays up her own block, played next by Entry. Jeeva plays the ball across, free ball played by Mosier for them. They go to the middle to Elise Walsh, dug up by Montserrat. Brown Ice goes to the outside, Jeeva off hands, and they make a stick save, and they'll get the second ball to Medic. Back row attack, Nicole Walsh, trying to do too much, hit the ball in the net. You know, a defensive specialist can really be overlooked, but I'm telling you right now, Maddie Montserrat, has made an impact in right set away. two. Wow. Those, those interchangeable DSs we've talked about, Paul Monterey and Nikki O'Rourke. If one's having an off night, you go with another. Pass, Medic. They go middle, Neff off speed. Didn't fool the Gators. Played up. Gators go middle. Kill! Simone entry. And I thought that set was going to be too low, honestly, for Simone, but it was perfect from Taylor Brown. She got it just high enough for Simone to take a swing, but not too high to slow the offense down. And that's the key, it happened so quick. A beautiful set. Holly Pohl serves, 11-6 Gators. Pass Medic near the net. They go to, who is that, Burrington? Yes, Sarah Burrington with the kill. Just a step behind the setter, and a nice look for her. Oliveira Medic now for them. One of three seniors on the squad. Here is her jump float. Pass Montserrat in left. Brown Ice goes to the outside. Jeeva down for the kill. Against two huge blockers, and Jeeva Rachel finds a way to get it done, that time down the line. Mallet back in for Florida. Raycheck to serve. Medich will pass right, Mosier middle, and Nicole Walsh left. Dave Boos on his haunches like a baseball catcher, gave the serve indication. Now here's the set to outside Nicole Walsh, and Nicole Walsh kills it. That time she goes down the line, thinking maybe a little bit more about the block in the middle as Florida is finally getting some touches on her, but that's going to be key. They've got to get some quality touches. Sarah Burrington, overpass, kill. Neff. Gators can't have these passing issues. That was too easy for the big front line of Florida State. Just whack it back across. Eight, excuse me, 12-9. Florida Lee trimmed to three. Pass on row, solid. Brown Ice didn't have to move. Goes to the outside to Mallet, and Mallet kills it. And in set one, looks like that. We're sailing long. That's the look we want to see from Gabby. Up over the block, but she's got the snap on it. That ball falls well in bounds. Entry ready to serve for the Gators. They pass Mosier right, Medich middle, and Walsh left. Pass Medich, as that one looked like it might be going long. They bump it to the outside. Nicole Walsh off the net. Is blocked by Chloe Mon and Taylor B. Great timing by Chloe Mon. That ball's well off the net. But you know Nicole Walsh is going to take a pretty wait. good rip on it. You know that's what they were saying. Chloe to Taylor, wait, wait. And they waited just right. Here's a serve for entry. Pass Medich, high in the air, near the net. They go to the right side to Elise Waltz. It's a block for Gabby Mallet and Chloe Mon. And the Gator fans respond with big applause. Flip the coin from set one to set two. The Gators, almost like flipping a switch, are playing sharp here in set number two after dropping the first and lead here in the second frame, 15 to nine. We're back for more set two action from the O'Connell Center after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network.
other Florida timeout had been all about the Florida side of the net. You know, we need to do this. We need to play better. This is the first time the coaches are sending in useful information where the holes are in the defense for FSU. So obviously Florida's raised their level of play. Thanks, Missy. Serve and play. They go to Neff, and Neff misses everything. But there's a touch called at the net. So a Florida State kill for Neff. And it's 15 to 10 for them. Luke checks back in along with Mara Green. And Luke to serve it. Gators pass but two. Pole left, Unruh right. Pass pole. Brown ice goes middle. Mon had to take something off. It was a low set. They bump onto the right side. Mara Green stuff blocked by Chloe Mon and Gabby Mallet. And Gabby Mallet, I haven't seen her this emotional ever. Screaming and hollering and trying to get her fellow teammates fired up. Serving for the Gators now is Taylor Brownice. Mosier right, middle Medich and left Walsh. Nicole Walsh, here's the serve. Short one, played by Medich coming in. They go to the outside to Nicole Walsh. Gators block it back. They play it up. They go to the outside again. She sends it in the back right, played up by Jeeva. Gators go to the middle. Mon is blocked. And that was a set that was way too low and all she had to do is try to push it across and push it into the block. So not a good look for Chloe. But a Florida State block nonetheless. 16-11. For them, here's Nicole Walsh serving. Pass Unruh. Brown ice goes to the outside. Mallet down for the kill as Medic coming from the left sideline and from the middle of the court, Mosier. Neither one could make the play. And they look at each other saying, I thought you had it. Or I'm guessing that's what they said. 17-11. And number 11 for Florida, who's been a key factor in this second set, checks back in. Maddie Montserrat serves. They go to the right side. Here's Mara Green. And she got it in. You know, not a tough, tough serve from by Maddie Montserrat. She keeps it in bounds. And, you know, the fans have complained about that all year. Just put it in bounds. But you see what happens with a quality opponent when the serve isn't tough. In Maddie's defense, she hasn't served that much lately. So I think she was just focused on keeping that ball in bounds. 17-12, serve for Mosier. Pass Maddie Montserrat. Brown ice goes middle. Chloe on gets it down for the kill. Hitting it into their back left. 18-12 Florida. Here's Taylor Runrun. Gators down a set if you just joined us. But leading here in the second by six. For them, passing right is Mosier, middle Walsh, left Medich. Walsh with that pass. They go right side and she mishit it. Did Mara Green. The set was too high and too far outside. Chris Poole has seen enough. He takes another timeout. Here, he's burned one, he's burned two now here in the second set. And the second set has been all about the Florida offense. Gators hitting 400 and limiting Florida State to only a 167 hitting efficiency mark to this point. Gators down a set in the second. It's Florida 19, Florida State 12. Back after this timeout on the Gator IMG Sports Network. was an issue, but here in the second, sparked by Maddie Montserrat off the Florida bench. The Gators have uplifted the offensive output, hitting 400 to this point, and lead 19-12. Florida State now out of timeouts, as the Gators will serve here with Taylor Unruh, looking to extend on this seven-point lead. Big serve, pass, Walsh. They go to the middle, and wow, Sarah Burrington, right in the middle of the Gator head, takes a rip. Floating to her right, gets the kill to make it 19-13. Burrington, only a red shirt freshman, but six foot five out of Ruskin, Florida. She's got a really bright future for the Seminoles. For them, here is Sarah Wickstrom, the other setter now back in. That means Elise Walsh is in. Played up who by, that was entry. Gators bump one to the outside to Jiva. Off hands kill for Jiva Raycheck. That's just Jiva being Jiva. 
Wow, and that's off of a bump set from right back. That's finding a way to score points when your team really needs them, and we all know Jeeva has the capability of doing that. 20 to 13. Here's Holly Pohl. Pass, that might have been going long, but they make the pass at the last moment. From the back row, Walsh, Gators block it, but it falls out of bounds off of Simone Entry. So Nicole Walsh gets the kill there. 20 to 14. For them, here is Oliveira Medic to serve. Gators pass Montserrat left, Unro middle, and Pole right. Serve fourth coming from Medic. Here it is. Pass, last moment, Montserrat. Brown Ice jump set to the outside. Jiva. She's dug up. Second contact, Medic. They have to send it across. Wickstrom with the free ball, played by Unro. Set the middle. Chloe Ma. No, it's Simone entry right down for the kill. I beg your pardon. Nice rip. Just Simone looks like Chloe. Entry. You know, and that was a tough serve to the corner. And Maddie Montre, as you said, played it at the last minute, but she played a quality ball. Jeeva to serve for the Gators. Gators up 21 14. Pass Nicole Walsh. They go outside to Nicole Walsh. Gators get a hand on it, but it's down for the kill. Boy, she's tough to stop in system. 21 the tempo 15. of their offense that set to the outside comes at you quick. And they have turned it up a notch. Watched them last night. It just seemed like it was a slow moving match they played against Georgia Southern. But they have really played well tonight. Laura Dodowski checks in for them to serve. Pass pole. Brown Ice goes to the pipeline. Jeeva off hands. Played up by Medich near the net. It goes across the net. Played up by Gabby. Set the middle. Tapped across by. Entry, they play it up easily. Go to the right side to Elise Walsh. Gators touch it, dug up by Unro. Second contact, Brown Ice. Back set, right side, Jiva. Caught to, to, by hands, Walsh to Neff. Gators played up, it was Jiva. Gators go to the slide play. They dig it up. Second contact, who? Elise Walsh. Dodowski sends across a free ball. Played by Unro. Brown Ice goes outside. Big boom, lowered, but it's dug up as Mallet was dug up. Gators go outside again to Mallet. She is blocked. And that set maybe just a little too low. Nowhere to go for Gabby. Florida ran Jiva Raychuk out of right back that entire rally to give them that back row attack. I like Jiva out of the back row when we need that as an option. But if it's not a necessity, I think there were a couple times early in that rally we should have gone ahead and gone to the front row. Mary Wise will burn a Gator timeout here, her first of the second set, as her team now has had its lead cut to five at 21 to 16 late here in the second set. Florida State up one set to none in the second. Again, it's Florida 21, Florida State 16. Back to the O'Connell Center after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Center floor in 2013. Second round NCAA Division I Volleyball Championship. The Florida Gators ranked sixth in the latest ABCA poll, hosting 16th ranked Florida State. The Seminoles up one set to none. Gators in the second set lead 21 16, trying to even this up as we go to the break. And on the court for Florida are Mallet, Brown Ice, Entry, Unro, Pohl, and Raychek. Serve for Dadowski for them. Pass, pole, Gators go middle. She's dug up his entry. They bump onto the right side. Elise Walsh sends across an easy shot for the Gators to play. Played by Jeeva. Gators go outside to Mallet. Mallet off the block. Got the kill. Florida first forced FSU setter to play first contact in that rally. So they didn't get a great swing out of that, even though they dug up the ball. It was their setter who dug it up. Entry serving now for Florida. That means Chloe Mon is back on the court for the Gators. Here's Entry. That bottom just drops out the last minute. Not a great pass. They have to send across a free ball. Chance for Florida. Played by Entry. Brown Ice goes middle. Mon is blocked. They play it into the net and goes to the kill for Chloe Mon. And she is so quick. She was right there to play that ball if it was going across the net after she swung. Wow. 23-16. Gators two points away from tying up this match at one set apiece. Entry to serve it again. 
Here it is. Pass made. Medich. They go outside to Walsh. Off the Gator blockers, it goes down to the court. It went twice off of Brown, I said, think. Bang, boom, off the block, then second contact. That's the tough one because everybody in the O'Connell Center knows where it is except the blocker who just touched it. It's right above their head, and they're spinning looking for it. 23-17. Here is Haley Luke to serve for them. And a look in the stands, and next to uh, Patrick Young is Will Yaget. Gator basketball team supporting. There's an overpass. Easy go for Nicole Walsh. You can't do that. That is one that just an easy point for them. Here's Luke to serve it again. Gators need good first contact. Pole left, Unro right to serve receive here. Pass pole. Brown Ice has to run to track it down for the back row. Jeeva sends it down this near side, played up. They go to the right side to Mara Green. She gets to the cross the net. Six stick save Brown Ice. Unro has to send across a free ball. Another chance on the free ball for them. They go middle to Neff. Tap shot though. And once Florida's in the net, Chloe on. 23-19. And now Jeeva Raychuk will step up in the pass, two instead of three. She'll be in the middle, three to her left two. is Pole, right? And to her right is Unra. Here's the serve. Pass Pole. Brown Eye sets the middle. Mon off hands. They play it up. Where will they go? To the right side to Green. Dug up by Unro. That ball will be in press row. It's a point for them. Gators have let FSU crawl back into this one. And it's now only a three-point lead. Gators led 22 to 16. It's now 23 to 20. Florida State State trying to come back here in set number two. Gators still with a three-point lead. A Gator timeout. We'll be back for the conclusion of set number two as both teams are out of timeout after this broadcast timeout on the Gator IMG Sports Network. led 23 to 7 excuse me 23 to 16 after a Chloe Mon kill FSU making it interesting here at the end of the second set yeah Gators not, need one pass not going away that's for sure and Florida really was on a roll there about midway through the second set you'd like to see them make a statement with a strong finish for Florida State serving is Haley Luke her fourth serve in this rotation Gators will pass pole left, Unro right, Jeeva behind them near the end line. Here's the serve for Haley Luke. Pass pole, Brown Ice didn't have to move. Go to the outside, Mallet. They play it up. They bump it to the outside. Nicole Walsh off hands, played up by Jeeva. Gators with a chance, go to Mon. She's dug up, didn't get much on it by Medich. They go outside to Nicole Walsh. Gators block it! It's down for the block and the Gators get the set point. 24 to 20. After them on kill. Set point for the Gators in a wet spot in front left on the court for Florida State as they try to get the perspiration up off the O'Connell Center floor. Taylor Brownice will be serving at set point for the Gators. They will pass Mosier right. Medich, it appears, will be in the middle. And Nicole Walsh left. Gators trying to get a point here to even up this match at one set apiece. Gator fans on their feet. Taylor B to serve. And here it is. Short serve. It's an ace. Just what the doctor ordered for the Gators. A service ace for Taylor Brown Ice. And the Gators will go to the locker room tied at one set apiece. After Florida State dominated set number one, the Gators come back with a great performance in set number two to even up this match as we go to the intermission at one all. Let's go now to Missy Whittemore, who is standing by with Florida head coach Mary Wise. Mary and A'd like to flush the first set, but Florida battles back to find a rhythm in set two. Yeah, you got to give all the credit to, to Florida State. They are playing so well. This is the best 
You know, we've, we've seen Florida State since 2010, and not that that surprises us, because we've had, they have the talent, they have the coaching, they know us. I think they have handled their adversity with their change in their roster uh, magnificently, and their players are playing lights out. We knew FSU was a good blocking team, but Florida used blocking to get some momentum and score points in set two. Yeah, huge by Chloe. I mean, how often does Chloe have as many blocks as she Camaro, Katie Mosier to serve. Floating serve, and it's an ace. As Nikki O'Rourke can't make the pass. Contact loving some balls that were off speed shots fall. Thank you, Missy. And plays made by Walsh. They go to the right side, and a kill on the right side for Mara Green. They will go to the outside and a kill for, they make a pass, go outside to Walsh. Skaters block it. D D'Agostino goes to the outside to Santos Lamb. Big rep. That one by the Gators. FSU goes to the right side to Walsh and Mallet goes down to the floor and can't play it up. So they go to the right side. Here's Elise Walsh and Elise Brownice goes to the outside to Mallet. Off hands, kills Gabby Mallet. And the good minutes coming in. They go right side to Green, and Green hammers it, played up. Gators go to the outside to Jiva, got it down for the kill. Benich near the net. They go to, who is that, Burrington? Yes, Sarah Burrington, Brown Ice, goes to the outside. Mallet, down for the kill as Medich. Walsh, they go to the middle, and wow, Sarah Burrington, played by Unro. Set the middle, Chloe him on, no, it's Simone entry right down. Gator basketball team supporting, there's an overpass, easy kill for Nicole Walsh. They go outside to Walsh. Off the Gator blockers, it goes down the court. It went, and here it is. Short serve, it's an ace! Just what the doctor ordered for the Gators, a serve. down, less than 20 seconds on the countdown clock. Patrick Young alongside Will You Get, one of the end zones, trying to get the students involved here as the teams are back on the court to resume this match in set number three. A very pivotal, pivotal set when it's tied at 1-1. Yeah, coming out of the locker room, those first five or six points can really dictate that third set. For Florida, the Gators in the court now to our right. Florida State in the court to our left. The Gators, Raychek, Mon, Monsere, Ray, excuse me, uh, Entry, Brown Eyes, Paul, and Monsere. One of the Florida Middles will be out for Unruh, who is the libero for Florida. For Florida State, it looks like Medich will serve to open up the third frame for the Seminoles. They already have their libero out there in Mosier with Wickstrom, Elise Walsh, Nicole Walsh, and uh, let's see who that is in the middle. Is that 12, Burrington? Yes, it is. So Florida will pass Paul right, Unro middle, and Montserrat left to receive serve of Medich, and we're underway in set three. Pass Montserrat. Go to entry. Entry will kill it. Great pass from Maddie Montserrat to start the third frame. Very good pass by Maddie Montserrat, and already she subs out, so that's how important that first pass is. They have her in there for just that one half of rotation. Gabby Mallet in for Florida. Here's a serve for Jeeva Raychek. Far side pass Walsh. They go middle to Burrington. It goes across the net just the dig. They just send it across with not much on it. Pole plays it up. Gators go to entry against one. Entry gets it down for the kill. Simone entry, the first two kills of set number three. Two nothing Florida. Simone had kind of gotten tied up in right front mm -hmm. in, earlier in that round. She just hangs out over there and Taylor sends her one back on the right side. Here's the serve for Jeeva. Short ball played. By Mosier, they go outside to Nicole Walsh, and Unro can't dig it up. And you see what the short serve does. It took their middle out. They weren't even able to push the set to the right side. But so they get the one option, but Florida still doesn't defend it. 
for Florida State here is Burrington to serve. Gators pass, but two. That is Paul on the right. Go to the outside to Gabby Mallett. Dug up, goes across the net, played up by Pohl. Gators go to entry. Entry gets it down for the kill. It's been the Simone entry show. Three looks, three kills here in set number three. And at least two of them a step behind Tom. Yes. So going behind the setter, maybe Florida trying to split FSU's block a little bit and make them more harder from side to side. Here's Simone serving now for Florida. That means Chloe Mon back on the court. For them, they will pass Nicole Walsh left, Oliveira Medic middle, and right Mosier. There, Libera. Here is Simone entry, readying to serve. And here is the jump float. Down the far side, pass as two passers collide. They pop one high in the air to Elise Walsh. Off hands, dug up Jiva. Brown Eye sets the middle. Mon got it down for the kill. 4-1 Florida. And again, a towel on Florida State side. I guess they're perspiring more than the Gators. Yeah, they've had to wipe up before quite a few times. Here's Simone Entry readying to serve, and here it is. Down the far side, pass made Walsh. They go to Burrington, no, excuse me, Neff, coming off that left sideline, that attack we saw Heather Wright so effectively for Florida back in the day. Just that one or two steps off the left sideline into the middle, and she makes the kill. So Neff makes it 4-2 after her kill. And serving for them now, their other setters checked in, Haley Luke. Here's her jump float. Pass, pull. Brown Ice barely had to move. Sets the outside to Mallet. Off hands. Dug up by Mosher. They go to the right side to Green. Dug up by Unro. Brown Ice goes to the outside again to Mallet. Off hands. Kill for Gabby Mallet. Quality dig by Taylor Unro. That's yes. the transition dig that you've got to have. To beat the big teams, you're going to have to dig them now and again. Your blockers can't stop every ball. Here's Taylor B to serve. And that means first look in set number three for Alex Holston. The Gators can get her on track. Another added bonus. They go to the Mara Green look. She bumps it across. Gators play it up. Go to Mon. Off hands. Played up by their setter. So they bump onto the right side to Green. Gators stop block for Mon and Mallet. And Gabby Mallet is more animated than I've ever seen her. And I have to tell you, with Gabby Mallet being questionable tonight, I knew we would miss her offense, but I thought maybe even more importantly would be her blocking ability against FSU. They have two big physical right sides. And Gabby provides a solid block. 6-2 Florida, here's the serve, played in the net. They play it out, they don't get it across. Service ace makes it 7-2. And that time the double quick offense actually hurts FSU. They got two players coming in quick, they're out of system. No outlet for them to go to there. 7-2 Florida. Florida State players readjust as Neff goes to the far side of the court. Now we're ready, here's the serve. Short one, played by Nicole Walsh, near the net. They get it across, free ball floor, the ball high in the air. Brown Ice goes right side, Holston looks, and Holston gets it down for the kill. Maybe that'll get Alex on track, it's 8-2 Florida. Gators lead is a half dozen. If you're Chris Poole, how long do you wait for a timeout? And he'll take one right here, right now, as the Gator fans are on their feet in the O'Connell Center. The Gators come out firing here in set number three and lead by a half dozen. This match is even at one set apiece, but in the third, it's Florida 8, Florida State 2. Back after this timeout on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Good start to set number three and leads Florida State in volleyball action tonight in the NCAA second round, 8-2. Florida, six kills and nine swings here to start the third frame, hitting 667. FSU has had nine looks, two kills, two errors. Teams break huddle. Let's go to Missy now for a report from the Florida huddle. Tom, Mary Wise giving Gabby Mallett some props for that kill she got high off blocker's hands. You know, you're going to have some blockers in front of you when you're playing against FSU and still finding a way to get the kill. That's quality swings. Thanks, Missy. Here's the serve for Taylor B. Another short one played by Nicole Walsh. 
They go to uh, look behind the setter and a kill for Ashley Neff. Just kept it in Florida's back right. Make it 8-3. For them, here's Nicole Walsh now to serve. Florida passes Unruh right and Jeeva left. Pass Unro, Brown Ice goes middle. Chloe Mon straight down for the kill. Hard to defend that. Quick bang boom. Kill for Chloe Mon. 9-3 Gators. Maddie Monterey checks in for Gabby Mallett. Monterey will serve it. She's given them a heavy dose of short balls. Let's see what she does here. Another short one. Played. They go to the right side. Mara Green. Gators got a hand on it. Dug up by Brown Ice coming in. Monterey steps in, bumps to the right side. Holston. And got a touch in the net. Kill for Alex Holston. 10-3 Gators after the Holston kill. As the Gators really have found an offensive rhythm now here tonight. After starting very slowly in set number one. Again, Montserrat to serve. Let's see if it's the short one again. Yes. A heavy dose of short left serves for them. They go to the middle of the Neff and Neff kills it. So the Neff kill makes it 10-4. And for Florida State... Here is Katie Mosier to serve it. Gators pass three, Montserrat right, no two. And Unro left, and Jeeva on this left sideline. Pass, Unro. Gators go right side, Holston again. Holston kills it again, and she's heating up. And Unro, what a beautiful pass. She's passed the last two balls that we've sided out. If but then Unro passes straight to the center. SEC libero of the year will now serve for the Gators, wearing the blue contrasting jersey. Takes a deep breath, toss, approach, jump, serve. In the net. Make it 11-5. And you can see some of the Seminole players a deep breath. Oh. That serve is over in that rotation. Because she has been hot lately, Taylor Unruh. For them, Sarah Wickstrom checks back in to set and now serve. Gators pass Unruh right and Maddie Montserrat left. Here was her serve, pass Maddie. Brown Ice has to bump it to the outside. Off the net, Jeeva dug up. They go to the outside to Medich. Off speed shot, played up by Unro coming in. Gators go to the outside to Jeeva. Dug up near the net. They send it across. I thought the ball hit the antenna. Gators go to the right side. Gators play it up. Bump it to the right side again. Holston sends it in the back left and misses. I thought the attack hit the antenna, and the up official says no. You saw the antenna moving, but no call forthcoming. Make it 11-6. Okay, Wickstrom to serve it again. Some real quality digs in that long run. Oh, yeah. And actually a great idea by Alex Holston. The ball was tight and she could have been blocked. I like the, the push shot into the deep corner. It was just a little long. Wickstrom serves. Played by Montserrat. Gators go to the right side to Holston. She is dug up. Second contact, Mosier. Medich off the net. Dug up by Montserrat and back left. Brown Ice goes to the outside to Jeeva. Off hands, dug up by Walsh. They go middle, and they get a kill from Burrington. Make it 11-7. Mary Wise calling signals out to Taylor Brown Ice. Again, Wickstrom to serve. Here's the Wickstrom serve. Pass Montserrat. Gators go right side to Holston. She is blocked. Burrington was up alongside Medich, and it's 11-8. Florida State trying to claw its way back, down as many as seven. Now it's only a three-point Florida edge as Florida Gator head coach Mary Wise calls the timeout, her first of set number three. This match even at one set apiece. Florida 11, Florida State eight in the third. Back after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Day gear and even Gator Walk bricks. It's great to celebrate the holidays and it's great to be a Florida Gator. 
NCAA second round action. Florida leads Florida State 11 8 here in the third. This match at one apiece. Let's go to Missy now for a report from the Florida Huddle. You know, Tom, it's just high level volleyball against some teams. You're feeling good if you just go up and have a nice look and take a strong rip at it, but that's really not enough here. So they're giving information to the players about where the defenders are not and asking them to actually move their shots, not just take a hard shot, take a hard shot and place it in the right spot as well. Thanks, Missy. After the service error by Wickstrom, her serve run is over at four. And here's Holly Pohl checking back in and she'll serve it, Holston out. Pass made, Walsh. They go to the outside to Elise Walsh. Dig goes across the net. Oh, Paul digs it up as they took a swing from the middle. Go to Raycheck on the outside, and she misses. Jeeva had a good look trying to go down the line, but missed it. 12-9. Here is Oliveira Medic to serve for them. Florida passes Monterey left, Unro middle, and Paul right. Medic readies to serve, and here it is. Jump float, pass, great Monterey. Go to the middle to entry. They dig it up. It was Medic. Second contact out to the right side to Elise Walsh, and she misses. So the attack error for Elise Walsh from the right side makes it 13-9 Florida. Here is Jeeva Raycheck to serve it now for the Gators. Short serve, pass made. It's a shank pass into the scores table far side. It's a service ace for Jeeva Raycheck. And for Raycheck on the season now, her 24th ace. She'll serve it again here in this situation with the Gators up 14-9. Pass made this time by Walsh. They go to the other side of that to the other Walsh, and Elise Walsh buries one. Make it 14-10. Burrington now will serve for them. Florida passes two, Paul right, Unro left. Pass, Unro. Gators go to the outside to Mallet, and she misses everything. That didn't look like a very good swing, unfortunately, for Gabby. 14 11. Burrington to serve it again for the but Gators. You wonder, Tom, if some of that is in thinking about their placement, going so hard for the corner there that she just sails it long. Mallet flips the wrist, keeps it in. They go to the outside. Here's Nicole Walsh, and that was nothing that Florida could play there, unfortunately. 14-12, it's the closest it's been in quite some time. Here's Noami Santos Lamb in for Gabby Mallet. Mary Wise with some coaching right to Gabby when she hits the bench. Pass Unro. Gators go to entry. She has to tap it across. They play it up easily. They go right side to Elise Walsh. Nick Santos Lamb got a hand on it. They play it. Bump it out to the outside. And it's long, or wide, I should say. It's out. The FSU attack error for... How about Noami? There. How about Noami hand fresh on. off the bench, blocks that ball back in bounds. Really well done. Here's entry to serve for Florida. That means that Chloe Mon is back on the court in the middle. Serve. Pass. Medic. They go to the outside to Walsh. The dig goes across the net, but Florida's in the net. Called on Mon. 15-13. Back in for them, Mara Green and the other setter, Haley Luke. Out goes Wickstrom along with Elise Walsh. Florida passes on row right, middle ray check, left pole. Luke serve forthcoming. Both teams have used one timeout. They both have one remaining. Pass pole. Gators go to the middle. Mon is blocked by Neff. The set wasn't really there, and Mon just tapped it. Chloe's behind the setter. They still try to stick with the middle set. They set her a back one, kind of right behind the setter, but it's not right on her right shoulder, so she's reaching across her body, trying to make a tip play, and she's not able to get enough on it to avoid the block. Florida State within one. Gators clinging to a 15-14 lead. Pass pole. Go to the outside to Santos Lamb. Off hands. It'll go out of bounds. Kill for Noami. Noami coming up big here when her name is called here. Pole out. In is Alex Holston. Taylor Unro gives Santos Lamb a little slap on the backside saying, nice job. Here's the Taylor Brown ice serve. Down the far side, pass Medich. Not a good one. The libero has to play it. On the outside, Nicole Walsh is blocked. They play it up. They go right side to Green. Dug up by Raycheck near the net. Mon taps it across. It goes across the net out of bounds. So Mon will get credit for the kill. And no surprise here, all of a sudden, Florida State has a wet floor again. Funny how that happens. Yes. 
Seemed like there were a lot of those wet spot locations at Arkansas years ago. All in jest, of course, but a lot of towels on the court here. 17-14, Florida's lead is three. Here's the serve for Brown Ice. Down the far side, past Medich. High in the air, they have to bump it to the outside. Walsh swings. Gators block it back. They play it up. They go to the outside again to Walsh. And she takes something off and goes around the block for the kill. A net violation called, but that ball was down anyway for Nicole Walsh. 17-15. Now Nicole Walsh is in the back row for them. Taylor Unrow. Passes right, left. There's Jeeva with the pass. Brown Ice sets the right side. Holston readjusts. She's blocked, played up by Maughan. Gators go to the outside to Santos Lamb. Down the line, kill for Naomi Santos Lamb. Nicole Walsh gets up off one knee and says, come on, that ball is out of bounds. But it looked like it was in from my vantage point as well. Naomi Santos Lamb has three kills and four looks. Wow. That's making the most of your time on the court. 18-15 Florida. Here's Maddie Montserrat serving. Short serve. Passed by Medich. They go middle to Neff. Dug up by Maddie Montserrat, but Florida's in the net. Called on Chloe Mon again. Great dig by Maddie, who served that ball, and then her made her way back onto the court and picks up the dig as well. 18-16. Serving for them is Katie Mosier, Gilbert. Montserrat right, Unro middle, and on the left sideline, pinned over here is Raycheck to receive. Pass Montserrat. Gators go middle. Mon dug up. They bump it to the outside. Here's Medich, off speed shot, played up by Unro. Gators go middle, Mon. Got it down for the kill. And Florida continues to side out with FSU, but they've been able to maintain this two point window. Back and forth we go. Mon out, Unro to serve. That means entry now on the front row. And now I'm sorry, the spread three, Florida 19, FSU 16. Unro readies to serve. Again, a wet spot on the court, Florida State side. We're ready to resume action. Unro readies. Toss, approach, jump, serve. Bullet near the net. They tap it across. Unro, Montserrat. Brown Ice sends it across. That was a save for the Gators. They go outside to Medich. And a block for Alex Holston. A solo stuff. Simone Entry not able to make the close to the right side. It's Alex Holston on her own. And this is a freshman growing up right in front of your eyes. Reaches into the hole and takes away the shot. Beautiful. 20 to 16 and head coach Chris Poole of FSU burns the second of his, his two timeouts here in set number three. The match tied at one, Florida 20, FSU 16 in the third. Back after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Center as the Florida Gators, sixth ranked in the latest ABCA poll, hosting 16th ranked Florida State in state rivals in second round NCAA tournament action. Florida State impressive in the first. Florida bounces back in the second. In the third, it's been toe to toe, but the Gators, as of late, have been able to keep that two to three point lead as we move late in the third. Now with a four point edge at 20 to 16 after a big block solo from Alex Holston. And fifth year senior Chloe Mon is not even on the court right now. Gets her teammates around her. A little discussion led by Chloe before Florida takes the court. I noticed also after the poor performance in set one, Florida didn't immediately go take the other bench. They exited to the hallway where I think their senior had a little talk with him at that time as well. Gators in the net again. And an off-speed shot easily played up by Florida and Simone Looks to the sky going, oh, it was me. You know, Florida's benefited from some great blocking tonight, but unfortunately, along with that, we've seen some blocking errors in the net. For them, Wickstrom checks back in. Their other setter, she will serve. That means at least Walsh is back on the court. Pass, Monterey. Set, entry is touched at the net and dug up. They go to the middle. Gators touch it, but it goes down for a kill for Burrington. 
20 to 18. Gator fans getting restless. Moments ago, it was a four point lead and a Florida State timeout. Gators need one pass here. Maybe look to go to Holston. Pass Montserrat. Gators go right side to Holston. She's dug up. They go to the outside to Medich. Medich kills it. That was the look Florida won, and it was a great swing by Alex Holston, but a really good dig by Florida State. 20 to 19. Mary Wise takes a Gator timeout. FSU on a 3-0 run after they took a timeout. Unfortunately for Florida, a net violation. And then two big kills. First for Burrington, then for Medich to get us where we are at 2019. We'll be right back after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. defeats Miami in three. Marquette defeats Louisville in three. American sweeps Georgia. Cal sweeps North Carolina. And uh, Colorado defeats Iowa State in four. Here it's Wickstrom to serve for them. Gators up by only one. Pass Unruh. Brown Ice tracks it down, goes to Jeeva on the outside, and she is blocked. They had to hang one to the outside and FSU had two blockers there. We're tied at 20. Gators haven't gotten a good look in the side out offense in a while. Let's see where Wickstrom puts this one. Pass Montserrat, good one. Gators go right side to Holston. She's dug up, but it goes at Chris Poole. He can't make the play. But prior to the timeout, the call was to Alex Holston for that play as well, and she got a great rip on it, but there Libero had a quality dig. This time another set play to Alex, a good pass from Maddie Montserrat, and this time Alex converts. 21-20, pole in for Holston, she serves. They go to the middle, Gators block it back, they play it up. They go to the outside to Medich. Dug up by the Gators, it goes across the net. Gators play it up. Montserrat bumps onto the outside, here comes Jeeva. She'll, no, it, it doesn't go down, I thought it was down. Pole plays the ball, goes to entry, and she kills it. Chris Poole wants a lift violation on a potential push shot from Simone Entry. They've given her more latitude for the middles in that situation. She just kind of threw the ball. A little bit more of a slam dunk than what we normally see by Simone, but as we've seen in the past, if anybody gets leeway with that shot, it's typically the middle blocker. Chris Poole right up off the bench quickly, but 22 to 20. Here's Poole to serve at a point here for Florida would be huge. Pass Mosier. They go to the outside to Walsh. Roll shot. Played up easily by Unruh. Gators go to entry. She's dug up. They have to bump one to Walsh on the outside. Dug up by Montserrat. Go to the outside to Jeeva. Down the line, kill Jeeva Raychek. High off hands, Jeeva Raychek. That is just such great ball control. Only a sophomore, and she just sees this game at a whole other level. Holly Pohl ready to serve again. Here it is, far side, pass made Medich. They go outside to Medich, dug up by Montserrat. Second contact on row near the Florida bench. Pohl sends it across, free ball for them. Played by Medich. They go to the middle to Walsh, and she hits it off the Gator blockers that didn't penetrate the play of the net. It falls on the Florida side off of entry and brown ice. 23-21. For them, here is Medich to serve it. Gators pass pole right, Unruh middle, and Montserrat left. The fans yelling at the server. Pass, pole. Brown Ice goes to the outside to Jeeva, roll shot. They play it up. 
They bump one high in the air. Waltz swings. Gators block it back. Entry and Raytech weren't fooled. Walsh tries a roll shot over the Florida block on a high ball hanging up at the net. Florida's block waits and hangs long enough to get a piece of it. Set point Florida. 24-21. Jeeva Raytech to serve. Here it is. Short ball. Played by Nicole Walsh. They go outside to Nicole Walsh. She'll kill him. I was just going to say we haven't called Nicole Walsh's name in a while. And there she comes up big on a set point opportunity to make it 24-22. She just came to the front row. Yes, she did. For them, here is Laura Dodowski to serve it in a big situation for Florida State. Point for Florida. It's a 2-1 Florida lead. Florida passes three. And she misses the service error for Laura Dodowski. And set number three goes to Florida as they tried to serve one right at Jeeva Raychek on the floor to far sideline. And she missed it going wide. Jeeva was pinned right on that far sideline. She saw it going to her right. She said, I'm letting it go. It's out. And Florida leads in this match two sets to one after taking the third, 25 to 22. Excuse me. In the set, Florida hit 263. Florida hit 220, excuse me, Florida State hit 222. And as we go to the break in between sets three and four, it's Florida leading Florida State two sets to one. Stay with us. Missy and I back for the call of set number four from the O'Connell Center after this timeout on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Ladies and gentlemen, the NCAA opposes all forms of legal and illegal sports wagering and has the potential to undermine the integrity of sports contests and jeopardizes the welfare of student athletes in the intercollegiate athletics community. For more information, log on to the web and go to don'tbetonit.org. The NCAA Division I Student Athlete Advisory Committee members are committed to a service-based relationship with Samaritan's Feet a humanitarian relief organization that works to compassionately wash the feet of impoverished children, provide them with a new pair of shoes to prevent disease and infection. This initiative is focused on volunteering and fundraising events around the country. O'Connell Center on this Friday night in December. And the Gators with a 2-1 lead now over Florida State as we move to set number four in NCAA Division I Volleyball Championship round two action. Teams have broken huddle. Let's go to Missy now for a report from the Florida huddle. Let's see if Missy is uh, on with us. And we'll wait to see if she can connect with us here in a moment. For Florida State now in the court to our right. Starts with Elise Walsh, Burrington, Nicole Walsh, Medich, Luke, excuse me, not Luke, Mosier, and Wickstrom. For Florida, Jeeva will serve. Pole, Unro, Brown Ice, Entry, and Mallet. Here's the serve. We're underway in set four. They go right side to Elise Walsh. Stick save Unro after the Gators touched at the net. Mallet swings and Mallet misses. So the Florida attack error for Gabby Mallet. It's 1 0 Florida State. For Florida State, here is Medich now to serve it. Oliveira Medich ready. Gators pass, but two. This is in left. Unro, not a good one. Bumped up by Pole to the outside. Mallet off speed, played up by Wickstrom. They go to the right side to Elise Walsh, dug up by Holly Pole. 
Brown Eyes sets the right side. Here's Jeeva from the back row. And it's down for the kill for Jeeva Raychek. Tied at one after the Jeeva Raychek kill. 1-1. One, one. And Chloe Mon back on the court. That means Simone entry to serve for Florida. Here is it. Here's the serve. Pass. Mosier. They go middle. And a kill for Burrington. Wow. 2-1. Florida State here, early moments of set number four. Alongside Missy Whittemore, I'm Tom Collette. Burrington now to serve it for Florida State. For the Gators, they will pass three with now Jeeva making that pass in the middle of the passing array. Gators go to the outside to Mallet. She is dug up by Medich. Ooh, that looked like an odd contact, but not called. A kill for Walsh. That ball spun out of the setter's hands with a weird spin on the ball. A couple of fans across the net putting their hands up with a spin on their hands, saying, where's the call there? 3-1 after the kill for Nicole Walsh. Burrington to serve it again. Pole passes left. Jeeva middle. Unrow right. Here's the serve. Pass. Pole. Brown ice goes middle. Mon down for the kill. And set four starts out as a slug fest. Both teams siding out back and forth. Taylor B. readies to serve for Florida as they pass three. Mosier right. Middle is Medich and left is... Medich makes that pass. It was Walsh and left. They go to Walsh on the outside. The block goes across the net off Holston. And Walsh is up there just to whack at it again. 4-2 Florida State here in set number four. They make the double switch. Elise Walsh out. Wickstrom out. In are Luke and Mara Green. And here is Luke to serve for the Florida State Seminoles. Here's her jump float serve. Pass Jeeva and left. Brown Ice goes to the outside to Mallet, and Mallet got it down for the kill. Florida State players on the bench going out, out, out. And one of the assistant coaches said, that's out by two feet. Well, that's not exactly true. I thought it got the line right on it. The line judge had a good view of it off to our right. Here's a serve from Montre who just checked in. Short bloop serve. Pass made, it goes across the net. Jeeva tapped it into the net. I don't know how it went across. They go outside to Walsh. Roll shot, played up by Montserrat. It goes across the net, Walsh kills it. I don't know what Jeeva was thinking on that first shot. She was below the net plane and pushed it across. Yeah, she wasn't quite there. She was on a tight block and she didn't release outside and just follow that ball. It really was kind of an overpass opportunity. Nicole Walsh now to serve for them. Gators pass only two. Maddie Montserrat with the pass. Brown Ice goes right side to Alex Holston. Down for the kill for Alex. And she is heating up after a great set number three. And you know, with Nicole Walsh having just served, she obviously is now in the back row. It's a great time for Florida to run some points. Yes, and her sister off the court, Mara Green, on that right side spot. This is where Florida could generate some points. And here's a point generator in serving Taylor Unruh. Pass Nicole Walsh. They go middle, and Neff got it in. They need a pass in that rotation to work the ball to Neff. She's their go-to there in that side out, and they got a good enough pass to do it. 6-4, Neff out, and now Burrington back in, and serving for them is Mosher. Florida passes two. Montserrat left, Unro right. Here is the serve. Pass Montserrat. Brown Ice goes right side to Holston. Off hands, it goes on the Florida side, played up by Montserrat. Go middle to entry, she is blocked. They just kept two blockers with her the whole time. 7-4. After the block for Green and Burrington. That's probably one of the few times where it's better to go ahead and shoot it to the outside because there was some quick play happening in the middle of the floor and the middle blocker didn't have to move to defend it. Pass, Unrow. Brown Ice tracks it down. Back set to Holston. Off speed shot, goes down for the kill. Great play by Alex. Smart freshman play right there. The ball is kind of dying inside. The set had to travel a long distance to get to her. She uses her roll shot. Stoppage in play again on the Florida State side as the towel crew is out on the floor. For Florida, Holly Pohl awaits to serve as Alex now is out of the lineup for the Gators. Her spot in the rotation now in the back row. Pohl serves. Pass near the net. They go outside. Roll shot, Medich. Played up by Pohl. Brown Eye sets the middle and sent into back left by Simone Entry. 7-6. Hey, Chris, Chris Poole doesn't like that. That's a tip shot sent into the back row. It splits two defenders, and neither one of them were able to make a play on it. And again, Florida State players call for the towel to come out. Chris Poole 
talks to all of his passers there with that opportunity. 7-6. Here's the serve for Holly. Pass. Walsh. They bump one high to the outside to Medich. Dug up by Monsoray. The ball goes out of bounds. Florida State side. 8-6. Wickstrom and Elise Walsh check back in for them. And Wickstrom to serve. Florida passes three. Monsoray left. Middle on row. And pole right. Three superb ball control specialists for the Gators. Here's the serve. Caught the net, in the net, error. 8-7. <laughs> I have to laugh because the fan behind is calling, where's the towel after the play? Here is Jeeva Raychek to serve now for the Gators. Trailing by just one. Pass Medich near the net. They go to the middle, attack. Gators got a hand on it, but it goes to the middle for Burrington. 9-7 Florida State. Medich to serve now for them. Unrow left, pole right to receive for Gators. On the right sideline is Jeeva Raychek. I guess she'll pass it if it's way over here. Pole cuts it off. Joust at the net, one by them. Gators play it up. Pole has to send across the free ball. Played by Neff. They go right side to Elise Walsh, and she kills it. Four. 10 7. Floor had been within two there for quite a while as the teams went back and forth. And now for the first time, that three-point spread, 7-10 Florida State. Gators need a point here. Medich serving. Pass Unruh. Brown Ice goes outside. Dug up. Mosier, second contact. They have to send across a free ball. Played by Jeeva. Gators go to the slide. Simone Entry delivers. Is good Best patience. look on the slide. Good patience on the part of Florida because they actually got the, the look they wanted. It was a beautiful first choice by Taylor Brown. Nice going to Gabby Mallett. She only had one blocker, not able to come up with the kill. And so that second time to stay patient and get another good swing. Entry readies to serve. They pass three. With Medich taking half the court. Pass Walsh. Not a great one. They have to bump it to the back row. Pole plays it up. Brown Ice goes middle. Mon dug up. They bump one to the right side off the net. Walsh, entry can't dig it up. Out of system, they get a kill. 11-8. Gators had a chance to cut it to one, couldn't do it. Again, a three-point lead for them. Serving is Burrington, one of their middles. Pole left, middle, Jeeva, right, Unruh. Pass Jeeva. Brown Ice goes middle. Mon, can they get it across? They will, but Mon sends it right back. FSU kind of, one of their players said, we got it back. Oops, Mond's yeah, right there. Great effort played by Florida State to get it over, but heads up by Chloe Mond to send it right back into the midst of that confusion. And this towel thing is really starting to upset the fans as every time Florida gets the ball, FSU calling for the towel. Fans voicing their displeasure. Chris Poole, of course, will use the opportunity to talk to his passers. And the Florida State players get a free huddle, basically, out of it. Here's Brown Ice, ready to serve now for Florida. Gators trail by 2 11 9 here in the fourth. Catches net. It goes across. Neff makes the pass. They go outside to Nicole Walsh, and Florida's in the net, caught on Brown Ice. Uh, actually, I think he's saying Holston. Holston? Okay, yeah. I thought it was five and a three together. <laughs> All right, 12 9. Gators try to inch closer, and then always there's something here in this fourth frame to hold him back. Luke checked in, as did Green. Luke serves. Pass Jeeva. Brown Ice goes middle. Mon. Off speed shot, played up by Green. Medich. Outside, Nicole Walsh. Dug up by Jeeva. Brown Ice goes back set to Holston. Off the block, kill for Alex Holston. Can the Gators get closer than two? 12 10. Maddie Monsoray in to serve. She is served a steady diet of short serves to them. Let's see if that trend continues. She's one of those Gator servers who has the short serve in her repertoire. Pass made Nicole Walsh. They go outside of Nicole Walsh. Off speed shot, Maddie digs it up. It goes across the net, Moira Green sends it back. And again, Florida using the short serve, getting the one option to Nicole that Walsh. That time, not even a full swing from her. That's got to be defended. Nicole Walsh now to serve for them. Unro passes left, Monterey passes right. Pass goes down to the floor as the two passers collide. Service ace. Now it's a four-point lead for Florida State. Gators have been frustrated in the side-out offense on occasion here in this 
fourth frame. Both coaches clinging to their two timeouts here in the fourth. Pass Unro is a shank. Another service ace. Mary's got to take a timeout here, and head coach for Florida Mary Wise will take one after back-to-back -back service aces from Nicole Walsh. It's a five-point lead for Florida State here in the fourth at 15-10. Florida up two sets to one, but in the fourth, it's Florida State 15, Florida 10. Back after this on the Gator, IMG Sports Network. Florida State will break huddle now off to my right. The Gators still around Mary Wise. As we await their return to the court, and now the Gators will break huddle. Let's go now to Missy Whittemore for a report from the recently concluded Florida huddle. Missy, what do you have for us? Um, as we had recently talked about, Florida does talk about forcing FSU into those one option situations and then not defending. So when Florida State's forced to use a roll shot, especially but are really challenging their defense to step up. That's the one that we've got to transition. Thanks, Missy. Three aces in a row as Unro lets it go by. She called it out the whole way, but it wasn't, unfortunately, for the Gators. 16-10. Walsh with the jump serve. Pass Unro. Gators go middle. Chloe him on straight down to the ground. But the Gators now will have to generate some points off serve. Like the first set, the Gators have had a lot of one and dones here from the service line. But guess who's serving? Taylor Unruh. See if there's some magic in that right arm. A bullet past Nicole Walsh. They go to the outside to manage. Off speed shot, played up by Brown Ice. Bump it to the right side. Here's Holston. Off hands. Kill for Alex Holston. 16-12. And after the Gators run three consecutive points, a timeout called for by Chris Poole, head coach of Florida State. And I beg your pardon, two consecutive points for the Gators as the Gators pull to within four at 16-12. We'll be back after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Two top 20 teams. Sixth ranked Florida leads 16th ranked Florida State two sets to one. In the fourth, it's Florida State 16, Florida 12, as Taylor Unro prepares to serve it again for the Gators. They pass Walsh right, middle Mosier, and left Medich. Let's see if there's some magic in this right arm of Taylor Unro, who has really served it well this year for the Gators. Here's the approach, the serve, pass Walsh. They have to bump it to the outside. Here's Medich, and it misses wide. An attack error for Medich. 
Taylor Renew consistently going down that sideline. Nicole Walsh having to pass nearly all of these. She's done a good job. That last one, though, they did have to bump set. Here's the serve for Unro, a bullet, and Florida is out of rotation. I think they call Taylor Unro stepping Football. on the line. Yes, the line judge puts that flag up earlier in this match. I noticed that she was very close. Well, that's an error the Gators could afford, not afford to have happen. Another four-point lead for Florida State late here in this fourth set. Pass Monterey, entry, dug up, didn't get much on it. They go outside to Medic, sends it across with two hands. Played it by Unruh from back right. Go to the outside to Jiva. Caught net. Medic played it in defense. Medic sends it across. High off hands. Played by Montserrat. Brown Ice goes to the right side. Here's Holston. Dug up nicely by Luke. They go back row to Walsh. Dug up by Unruh. Brown Ice steps in. Sets the outside. Jiva off hands. Dug up by Walsh again. They go outside to Medic. Roll shot. Played up by Taylor B. Bump set to the right side. Here's Holston. Holston terminates. Huge wow. swing from the right side for freshman Alex Holston. A long rally. Florida in what was considered out of system. FSU has to like where they've got him, and Alex still makes it hurt. Made the floor hurt with that shot. No that kidding. ball was pounded. Here's Paul checking in for Holston and serving. Pass Nicole Walsh. They bump it to the back row. Walsh sends it across, played up by Unro. Brown Ice goes to entry. Entry is dug up by Walsh. They go to the outside to manage. Gators block it. Entry is there alongside Brown Ice. And I think Brown Ice got most of that one, and she did a good job not only getting it, but turning it back in bounds. 17 15. Again, pole to serve. She has served it very deep tonight. Had a good stroke with that flat footed serve. Another good one past Walsh. They go to Burrington, and Burrington kills it off of entry. Both of their middles like to use that front slide that we've seen in the past. They travel along the net, but then hit it off one foot in front of the center. 18-15. For them, Wickstrom back in. She'll serve it, along with Elise Walsh. Pass Unro. Brown Ice goes to the outside to Jiva. Down the line, dug up. They go outside to Medich. Dug up by Monterey. No one's going to get there for Florida as the ball just falls in front left. Taylor Brown has got hung up over here in right front after blocking, and then she's not able to track that one down. Mary Wise will take the second of her two timeouts here in set number four. Gators in a four-point hole at 19-15, up two sets to one. We'll be back after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Sun Gator Kids Club is the official fan club for Gator fans, sixth grade and under. For only $21, you'll receive a Kids Club t-shirt, backpack, discounts to Gator locker room, free admission to select Gator athletic events, and much more. Siblings can join for a low cost of $10. Sign up now by calling 1-800-34-GATOR or visit GatorZone.com slash Kids Club. On the court for Florida State, Burrington, Medich, Elise Walsh, Mosier, Nicole Walsh, and Wickstrom serving. For Florida, Brown Ice, Entry, Raychet, and passing left to right, Monsere, Unro, and Pole. Here's the Wickstrom serve. Gators in a must point situation. Pass. Brown Ice goes to the outside. Jiva, dug up, goes across the net. Jiva swings again and kills it. That's what you like to see on the overpass. Make no question about it. Come up with the kill. Yeah, that was a pretty good swing for Jiva there. With authority. And now Jiva will serve. Gators needs to score some points off serve, though, to get back in this set. They go to the right side to Elise Walsh. Taps it in the front left, and Mallet couldn't make a play to her left to make the play. 20 to 16. For them, Medich to serve. Florida passes two. Unro left, pole right, and Jiva pinned on this right sideline. 
service error. That's a good thing for Florida. That'll help, that'll help. Entry now to serve, Chloe Mon on the court for the Gators. They will pass Medich right, and Mosier left. Pinned on this left sideline is Nicole Walsh. Nicole makes that pass. They go to the outside to Nicole Walsh. Dug up, but did someone get there? No. It's over the table off to our left. So kill for Nicole Walsh. 21-17. The short serve at times has been effective, but at times like that, not so much. It becomes a pretty easy pass for FSU. Timeout called by Mary Wise, the second of her two here in set number four, with the Gators up two sets to one. But in the fourth, it's Florida State 21, Florida 17. Back after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. team takes on second ranked Kansas in the O'Connell Center this Tuesday at 7 o'clock the first 1,000 students receive Billy Donovan bobblehead dolls the fan interactive area Alligator Alley is open between gates one and two with face painting basketball games and more and the 2013 national champion Florida gymnastics team will be signing autographs that's Tuesday night tonight it's volleyball action second round NCAA Tom Collette and Missy Whittemore with you Gators up two to one in sets, but trailing here in the fourth, 21-17, as Dadowski serves it for them. Brown Eye sets the middle, tap shot. They dig it up. They go right side to Elise Walsh. Unruh with a great save. Go to Mon, and Mon kills it. And if it doesn't work the first time, go to her again. I like the way they get the ball to Chloe Mon twice. 21-18. Gators need to score some points here, though. Down by three late in the fourth. Here's the serve for Taylor B. Pass made Nicole Walsh. They steer one all the way out to Nicole Walsh. And the Gators block it. Brown Ice was up alongside Maughan. That pass did create that one option opportunity. And that time Florida capitalizes on it, puts up a huge block, was able to score. And I take it back. It was Holston three, not eight. Brown Ice up. Brown Ice is serving. 21-19. Brown Ice ready to serve it again. Pass Medich. They miss connection on that front slide. 21 to 20. It's their final timeout, and the fans in the O'Connell Center have new life. Yes, they As the do. Gators, trailing by four, have cut it to one at 21 to 20, forcing Chris Poole to take the Seminole timeout. So both teams now out of timeouts will play to the end after this timeout on the Gator IMG Sports Network. to fourth to fifth. Tom Collette, Missy Whittemore with you. Second round NCAA match and Oliveira Medich with some discussions with the up official there. Paul Albright now should go back to pass middle. To her right is Mosier, to her left is Nicole Walsh. And after the timeout, the serve for Florida's Taylor B. In a big spot, a point here, we're tied at 21. Taylor B with the jump float. 
past Medich. They go to the outside to Walsh. Offhand, skaters can't dig it up. Oh, they got a touch on the block, too. And really not a hard driven ball no. from Nicole. She's taken something off of that, and it's falling in front of the defenders. Mm. For them, they make that double switch. Mara Green on the court. Also Haley Luke and Haley Luke to serve at 22-20. A point, a must for Florida here. Pass Jeeva. Brown Ice goes middle. Mon is dug up by Medich. They bump it to the right side to Green. And she gets it in. Gators had a golden opportunity with Mon, and she couldn't get a lot of mustard on it. And then a long swing from Green, FSU's right side, a long swing deep into our right back corner, not a hard hit ball, no. but she finds the corner. Well placed. Here's the serve, pass Jeeva. Brown Ice goes right side, Holster, blocked. Gators keep it alive, but hit the antenna. 24-20. Looks like we're going to five, folks, unless the Gators can pull some fourth set magic here. It's set point for them at 24-20 with multiple opportunities. Florida passes two. Jeeva with that pass. Not a great one. Brown Ice tracks it down. Has to throw one to the outside to Santos Land. Moser digs it up high in the air. Medich second contact. Walsh, Gators block it. Off of Mon and Holston, the Gators have new life. 24-21. Gators put Maddie Monsore in for Naomi Santos Lamb, and Maddie will serve. Gators need to score three in a row. It's that simple. Does Maddie have the trifecta in her? Short serve. Pass Walsh. They go nowhere. It's illegal contact. Double hit called on them. There's one. Monsore to serve it again. An ace here would be huge. They make the pass, Medich does. They go outside to Walsh, off hands, dug up. It goes, in. oh, is that over the net violation? I guess not. I thought she might have gotten it early. Yeah, I, I thought she was a little anxious. She 25 to 22. She definitely went up and got it, and I don't know if that, if that rule is affected by Florida's ability to make a play on it, because they really weren't in position to make a play on it. Well, we're going to a fifth set as we did in 2010. The last time these two teams met in the NCAAs here on this same court as Florida State in a must win situation comes back and takes the fourth 25 to 22, forcing a fifth and deciding final set tonight in this second round match. Stay with us, we're back with the call of set number five between Florida and Florida State with a spot in the Sweet 16 on the line after this timeout on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Sweet 16 bid on the line. 
Florida, Florida State. Gators were up two to one with a chance to close it in four and couldn't quite seal the deal. As Florida State hit 333 in the fourth, Gators hit 314. More opportunities for Florida State. They had six more swings in that set. And Tom, did FSU lead the entire fourth set? I don't think Florida was ever able to tie that one up. Florida State came out, created a very small window at the beginning of the fourth set, and Florida was working from behind the whole time in this fifth set. Closest they got was 21-20. In this fifth set, when you are coming, uh, when you're only going to 15, these first five points are so, so big. Everything magnified here is, it looks like Medich will serve them. Seminoles in the court to our right. Gators in the court to our left to open up this fifth and final set. As the Florida State cheerleaders rush to get on their side of the court, and now the Florida cheerleaders will go the other way. Medich to serve. Gators pass pole left. Jeeva middle and Unroe right. Medich, one of three seniors on their squad, serves it. Pass Jeeva. Set the middle. Mon kills it. The first pass is huge. Jeeva Raychuk puts it right in her setter's hands. Go to Chloe Mon, and that first point is on the board for Florida. It was tight. Tight to the net. Here's Brown Ice to serve for the Gators. They pass Medich right, Mosier middle, and Walsh left. Here's the serve. Pass Nicole Walsh. They go right side to Elise Walsh. Gators dig it up. The dig goes across the net. Played by Medich. They go to the outside to Nicole Walsh. Gators can't dig it up. Nicole Walsh now with a match high. 21 kills. The next closest player, Ashley Nett, for FSU with 13. Florida's kill leaders, Chloe Mon and Simone Entry with 12 apiece. Serve for them. Gators go to the outside to Mallet. She'll get it down for the kill. Back to back to back. Quality swings, and these teams are scoring points with offense. We'll see who can come up with a some defense, defensive yeah. dig. Montserrat, who sparked the Gators in set number two with her back row play, now serves. Pass made, awkward pass. Mon slaps it down for the overpass kill. You know, and I wondered at the end of set four if they were going to use Maddie back there to serve a driving serve. She's gone short all night. Finally, here in this fifth set, they drive one, and I think it catches the passers a little off guard. Caught them off guard, yeah. Pass. They go right side to Elise Walsh. Gators get a hand on it, but not enough. 3-2. Florida's lead trimmed to one. Out goes Elise Walsh. Out goes Wickstrom. In is Haley Luke. In is Mara Green. Haley Luke to serve. Gators pass Unro left and Monterey right. Jeeva pinned on that left sideline over there. If it's right on the sideline, she will pass. Pass Monterey. Not a good one. Have to bump it to the right side to Alex. She's dug up by Medich. They go to the middle, and she got a hand on it. Oh, it's down. She didn't get much on it at all on her way down, but she gets it into a spot where Florida didn't have a player. Ashley Neff uses an open hand tip shot right into the center of the court. 3-3. Three, three. Chloe Mon will take a towel to the court as Gators will pass Jeeva left, Unro middle, and Maddie Montserrat right. That's a smart fifth-year senior move. Chloe Mon calls for the towel. All right, here we go with Haley Luke tied at three here in set number five. Pass Montserrat. Brown Ice goes to the outside. Jeeva off hands. Kill Jeeva Rachek. It wasn't a perfect pass by Maddie, but she stayed with it. The ball was moving on her a little bit. She gets just enough of a pass up there to allow Taylor Brown Ice to set the outside. All right, here's Unro to serve for the Gators. They pass Mosier right, Medich middle, and Nicole Walsh left. In the net, error. It almost looks like she was thinking about where her feet were as she approached that time. Last time she served, it was a footfall. Tied at four. Here is Nicole Walsh to serve for them. Gators pass Jeeva left, middle Monterey right, Unro. Pass Maddie. Gators go to the outside. Jeeva with an off speed shot, played up easily. They go middle, Neff, off speed shot. Holston got a second contact. Holston sends it across, free ball. Almost played by their setter. They go back row to Walsh. Caught net, fell in. Are you kidding me? That's a lucky bounce for them. And FSU is going to keep going after Maddie Monster right here and serve receive. And I'm wondering if they're going to have Jeeva pull in and pass a little bit more. 5-4 Florida State. Their first lead 
here in set number five. Jiva passes left, middle Montserrat, right Unro. That's where uh, I believe Holston went down to make that play, wet spot on the court. Now we're ready to resume. Everything magnified in the short set to 15. Here is Walsh to serve for them. Pass Unro. Brown Ice tracks it down, sets the outside. Jiva, not much on it. Medic, they go outside to Medic. Off hands, kill Medic. Right now, Florida not passing at a high enough efficiency to run their offense. These balls have been hung to the outside past the antenna, both of these balls, and Jiva not really able to put much on them. She's just really trying to keep them in bounds. Gator head coach Mary Wise Burns, the first of her two timeouts here in set number five with Florida State leading six to four. Back after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. Serving. Florida passes Jeeva left, Maddie Montserrat middle, and Unro right. A point, you need it here. Pass Maddie. Brown Ice goes to middle. Entry is touched and dug up. They bump it to the right side. Mara Green. Gators block, but it goes out of bounds. The kill for Mara Green. 7 4, Florida State. Gators struggling to find some offense in this rotation. Got to get a good pass so they can get the ball probably to Holston on the right side here. A point here for Florida State will have that team's exchanging sides. Go to Holston on the right. Didn't get much on it. Dug up by Mosier. They go to a pipeline attack. The Gators stuff blocking. Ray check and entry are there. Gators Florida, needed that. Yeah, you know, they had a nice look from Alex on the right side, but it wasn't much on that ball. Not a typical look from Alex, and so Florida definitely needed defense to step up there. It's a huge point off of a block. 7-5. Pole serves. Overpass. Jiva taps it back down for the kill. A great serve by Pole. It looked like it might be going long, but they played it the last minute that the passer. It's 7-6. Pole's been driving some serves deep here in this match tonight. There's another deep one. It goes behind the passer. They make a second pass. Free ball, Florida, played by Montserrat. Brown Ice goes outside, Chiva. Their dig goes across the net, played by Pole. Brown Ice goes across the net. They play it up. That ball looked awkward, but they won't call it. It's a play for Medich on the kill. That's huge for Florida State. That was Florida had a free ball opportunity, and there's something they really have to convert on, on that free ball opportunity. But what an ugly second contact. I thought that'd be called a double hit. 8-6 Florida State as the teams change courts. 8-6 Seminoles now on the court to our left, the Gators in the court to our right. Serving for them. Let's see what rotation they're in as they, are they making substitutions? Uh, I believe so, yes as here comes back into the match for them. Burrington serving is Mosier. Their libero, Gators pass, pole right, Unro middle, and Montserrat left. Here's the serve. Pass Maddie. Brown Ice goes to the outside, Chiva winds up, she is blocked. Unro tries to make a dive at the end line, but it's for naught. FSU block, 9-6. Three point hole the Gators are in. Montserrat out, Nikki O'Rourke in. Nikki O'Rourke hasn't been in since the first frame. 
9-6. Florida needs to score a point here. Can't afford to go down another point. Pass Unro, solid. Gators go to the outside to Jeeva. Entry swings, they play it up. As the dig went across the net. There's the legal contact called. I thought on the first ball we would go back to Simone. We've been forced to, to set Jeeva so many times with the bad passes. We finally get that good pass, and you know perhaps that's what Taylor's thinking as well. They're going to expect us to go back, so she goes to the outside. But I'd like to see Simone get some rips. They bump onto the outside to Medich. Paul can't control the dig. 10-7. Will Mary Wise take a timeout? No, maybe not. She has one left. They make that double switch. Elise Walsh back on the court along with Sarah Wickstrom. Gator fans trying to urge the team on. Pass Unro. Bump set to the outside. Mallet back in. She's touched and dug. They go to the outside. Medich off speed. Played by Jeeva. Gators with a chance. Go to entry. She's dug up. They go to the right side. Gators block it back. They play it across the net and in. And they just bump one hard into the right back corner and kind of catch Florida standing there. Four point deficit for Florida late now here in set number five. Mary Wise burns the second of her two timeouts here in the fifth frame. 11 7, Florida State in the fifth. Back after this on the Gator IMG Sports Network. with one contact, and that first contact is a pass after receiving a serve here from Sarah Wickstrom. Unro and Pole to receive serve for the Gators. On the court with Raycheck, Mallet, Entry, and Brown Eyes. There's the buzzer. Timeout is concluded. Here's Wickstrom. Approach the serve. Pass Pole. Brown Ice goes middle, entry. They keep it alive, that's a lift violation. FSU doesn't like it. They say that she made a legal contact there, like a self-defense kind of move in front of her, but the official stays with it, of course. Looks like she pushed it to me from this vantage point. And where she went down to make that play from her knees, there's a wet spot. For Florida, Mon is back on the court. You have to like this now, as the Gators get her for three rotations across the middle. If the Gators can score some points with entry serving, it's a good spot for the Gators to be in. They pass three with Medich left, middle Walsh, and right Mosier. But she serves it in the net. 12-8. Tough spot for a service there if you're a Gator fan. Mary Wise pumps both fists saying, come on, we got this. Unro back on the court, passing right. Jeeva middle, pole left to receive serve of Medich. Pass pole. Go to Mon. She's dug up by Medich. They go to the right side to Walsh. She kills it. And you know, that seems to have been the story here in the fifth set so far is that Florida will be in system and get a look and they don't quite get much on anything it. on the ball. They're not able to terminate. And we've seen when FSU is in system that they've had that ability to terminate. Five point lead for Florida State, late. Let's see if the Gators have some magic. Nope, service aces, pole doesn't make the pass. It's match point for Florida State. Multiple opportunities here. And the Florida State fans, unfortunately for Gator fans, the FSU fans across the way are Starting to chant FSU and bouncing up and down. A little bounce in their step. Here's the Medich serve. Pass, Jeeva. Gators go middle. Mon gets the kill. They call it touch. There was a the touch. 
Yeah. Gators have to score five points here. That's the gist of it. And Taylor B, one of the two seniors, will serve it. Pass made. They go middle, and they'll kill it. A kill in the, a kill in the middle for Burrington. And Florida State is moving on to regional play. For the Gators, the first time they have not made regional play since 2004. And a second round loss in Tallahassee, of all places, to Stanford at Florida A&M. A terrific season for Florida ends with disappointment here in the round of 